Hello and welcome everyone to Nintendo at Gamescom 2018 and with that hello and welcome to the Nintendo Red Cube rocking some Nintendo themed socks. <laughs> Joined by my lovely colleagues here from Nintendo of Europe. Hey guys, it's good to have you. It's Hello. Filippo. Hi everyone. KW. Hey everyone. And Chris. Hello. It's so great to have you here. We're going to talk about a really exciting topic. We're going to talk about Labo. Yes. So, um, as most of you probably know, Nintendo Labo is a very unique kind of software because it's built around the uh, concept of make play and discover. Yeah. So you make your own cardboard creations pr uh, with the flat cardboard sheets provided in the box and following the instructions of the game. Then you play the games that are inside the game and then you can discover how everything works and also what else you can do with your cardboard creations. And so far this year we have released the Variety Kit and the Robot Kit. And soon, on the 14th of September, we will release the Vehicle Kit. Yes! And the Vehicle Kit is quite exciting because it allows you to explore an open world in three different really cool vehicles. So um, we're here to show them off. Yes. So the magic all starts with the Toy-Con key. Because, of course, every vehicle requires a key to start. And then there is the Toy-Con pedal. And the pedal is used to accelerate your vehicle. And then we have the three main stars of the show. Um, we can grab those stars. <laughs> so this is the Toy-Con submarine, mm -hmm. which if you twist the dials, you can control the two engines of the submarine independently. Um, here I am holding the Toy-Con car, and uh, you will insert the key here, then you'll be able to turn the steering wheel around. There's also some levers on the side that you can action, as well as a handle that you can pull over here. So good, yeah. And here I have the Toy-Con plane, which you can move around to steer a plane, and you also have a trigger button here. Yeah, so while we are not able to show new gameplay of the vehicle kit today, um, we can have a look at the uh, trailer with which we announced the vehicle kit, and it will actually already give you quite a few hints of what you can explore. Let's do it. So here we see the luckiest kid in the world, because he got to play Labo, Nintendo Labo early. <laughs> So, of course, you make first all of the creations being made, the make, the key, which is a key component in, uh, in the vehicle kit, and oh, for that pump. And here we see that by using the pedal you accelerate, then you can use the steering wheel to turn around. And finally we also see here that the handle will trigger a boost. And as the key switches to the toy plane, as you see, you can steer your plane by moving and really, it really feels like a flight stick. And uh, you can even shoot missiles by pressing the trigger. But before you know it, you have seamlessly switched to the submarine because um, that way you can submerge yourself underwater, try to find all the secrets that are hidden underwater and simply swapping the key, where did I leave it here, from vehicle to vehicle allows you to constantly swap between the vehicles and explore the entire world. <laughs> and if you use the button on the submarine, you will actually be able to shoot your anchor. There are also tons of other activities, so there really is a lot of gameplay that awaits. In and we also see co-op. Yes, exactly. Many multiplayer options. And it's the uh, best way to learn how to parallel park. Yes, actually, you know, a lot of people are probably parallel parking. I think Labo will help them with that. <laughs> the vehicle kit of Nintendo Labo will help them with that. Up, oh, I will take this back. Yeah. So, actually, now uh, we wanted to showcase uh, something, again, uh, an exclusive announcement that we can make here first, and uh, a, a unique collaboration. Uh, you might have seen that with the Variety Kit, we have made compatible the uh, software Mario Kart 8 Deluxe yeah. with the Toycon motorbike. And now, 
for uh, the uh, very first time we can announce and showcase that uh, as many people were already expecting the Toycon car <laughs> will be compatible so with good. Mario Kart 8 Deluxe. Yeah, it will become compatible after the vehicle kit releases, mm -hmm. but we can already showcase a race where we can... Let's do a classic kart versus <laughs> motorbike race. Yes. The old rivalry. The old rivalry settling its Labo style. Nice. So, Chris, I suggest we go for 150cc. 150cc, always good. There we go. So... Just confirm the controllers here. So, Kabe, according to your socks, I guess you're going to take Mario? Exactly. <laughs> I will be playing Mario here. And uh, Chris will join me with Link. Yeah, so I will be playing Link on his Master Cycle Zero, which was actually also uh, released this summer um, for Mario Kart 8 Deluxe. So, there are some really cool post launch updates that have been uh, added to Mario Kart 8 yeah. Deluxe. Yes. And uh, uh, it's actually quite interesting how you control the uh, Toycon car. How do you control a, a go kart in Mario Kart Deluxe using the Toycon car? So uh, you actually uh, use the accelerator pedal, the Toycon pedal, to uh, well, of course, to accelerate. But if you floor it, if you press fully, then you can also drift. Uh, and just so make to make sure that everyone has seen it, KV has put the key inside the car Toycon to bring it to life. So of course you steer by steering uh, the steering wheel and you accelerate uh, by uh, pushing the pedal down halfway. If you push it down fully, you drift and you can use the item by honking on the key <laughs> at the center of the screen. We're going um, to see that. So this is the functionality with uh, uh, Mario Kart 8 Deluxe. Actually, when you play with uh, uh, Nintendo Labo software, you can even modulate oh. your acceleration and it really feels like the real thing. But now I wanted to comment a little bit on this race. We can see uh, Kave using the drift to get the mini turbo out of the of the race, and of course you can also do the rocket start oh. if you uh, accelerate at the beginning of the countdown, just Sorry, like when playing with normal controllers. Yeah, no problem. And uh, we see that, uh, as usual, Chris is not competitive at all, especially <laughs> when playing Mario Kart. And uh, he's already... There is only one way to play Mario Kart, and that <laughs> is to try and hit your friends. Yes, it's disrupt the others, oh. right? It's yeah. not trying oh. to win, but make other people miserable. Ah, uh, it's a balance. <laughs> it's a balance, <laughs> yes. So, here we see how you really need to move your body fully when you're playing with the Toycon motorbike. Like in a real motorbike, you know, bending is as important as steering. Whereas when KV is uh, using uh, the steering wheel, you need to keep control of how tight you, uh, you turn by twisting the steering wheel. You know, if um, our fans have experienced motion controls with Mario Kart, with the Mario Kart series oh, since actually Cafe. many titles. Already since the Wii times, you could uh, uh, play with motion control. But here, instead, we of course use the motion control in the steering wheel, but we have a real authentic feeling of controlling a steering wheel. Yeah. Uh, it's almost, almost like the real thing. Chris, what's going on? Well, I am stuck in the crowd. <laughs> we all know this feeling. Sometimes yeah. it happens. Of course, normally, I always... Uh, perform much better. Yeah. <laughs> no, we all know that, right? Once you're in the middle of the group, it's really hard. Well, yes. sometimes. You gotta be fortunate sometimes. Yeah. Plus the pressure of the presentation, of course. Which pressure? <laughs> <laughs> what are you talking about? The one, the one that makes you go fifth. Oh, fifth? No, 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 that was not the pressure. Oh, no. That was just some red shells. <laughs> yeah, yeah. We all know how it feels, you know? <laughs> Ah. Ooh. Ooh. He's catching up. Kabir, no! <laughs> I'm getting hit by everything. Yeah. Actually, like that uh, to throw items uh, uh, when uh, you're using the Toycon oh, car, no. you have oh. to press. Yeah. On, because then you get, of course, the no, funny. Like, bang, bang, oh, bang, bang. When oh, Kabir, this is a disaster. No! <laughs> oh, no. Everything is going wrong. <laughs> well, oh, wow. Of course, nobody, <laughs> of course, nobody yeah, will believe you, will believe us, but. Uh, they win consistently <laughs> in every rehearsal. They really do. Uh, and oh, of course, incredible. now uh, we got seventh and ninth <laughs> position. I blame it on the items. I blame yes, it on the of items. Of course. I apologize for that one red shell. <laughs> it's to okay. You. It's okay. <laughs> but you know, uh, still we can see that it's a very authentic uh, Mario Kart experience with yeah. Mario uh, Kart 8 Deluxe and the it's, Toy Cars. It's just really fun. <laughs> and uh, I personally really love that you have to really throw your weight into the motorbike. And the funny thing is, Kave 
doesn't have a driver's license. He's like, <laughs> this is the closest I'm ever going to get to getting a driver's license. <laughs> probably, <laughs> yes. Well, probably not this one <laughs> that close, but... Uh, in the future, with uh, the uh, vehicle kit uh, releasing on the 14th of September, Cave <laughs> will have more time to practice. It's yeah. so cool. Sure, for sure. People and are I already used more. to the fact that Labo is so realistic in like everything, like the feeling when you use it, the feeling when you play with it, and the feeling when you build it, of course, and discovering more options to further discover, explore, build stuff. But now seeing you guys play it, it's really great to see how much realism is in there. Like yeah, well, it's it's really cool how um, it really adds another piece of life to the um, to the way that you yeah. use your toy con. I mean, these are creations that you've built yourself. You've really made put a lot of effort in, and it's so cool that you can use them also in Mario Kart 8 Deluxe. Yeah, I mean the level of satisfaction when you build your own toy con and then use it is unprecedented for me. Right. And yeah. uh, we were like really, we all became like little kids when we were working on this in the office. <laughs> yeah, so, Filippo, I think um, there's one more thing that we yes. uh, can there talk is about today. Actually, uh, we uh, wanted to talk a little bit about the uh, Nintendo Labo Creator Creators Contest Europe. Yes. So, as uh, many people know, inside the Nintendo Labo, there is the Toycon Garage. Mm -hmm. The Toycon Garage is a powerful but simple tool that allows you to create your very own toy con so you can with a bit of fantasy a bit of cardboard some scissors maybe you can create your very own toy con from scratch you can create your very own game experiences actually outside our red cube here at gamescom we have some of the creations that uh, the uh, german um, creators have made which are amazing they're so surprising and uh, talking about the uh, creator contest europe we have also announced a very special series of rewards for uh, people winning each category. We have announced a Nintendo Labo themed special edition Nintendo Switch console Ooh. and dock. We have shown this in pictures before, but I am really happy to announce, people might have guessed from <laughs> this uh, red uh, cloth here, that uh, we have one of the first prototypes here, one of the very first uh, uh, out of the production line, and uh, I can show it to you guys now. Ooh. There you go. <laughs> Ta -da -da -da. <laughs> so, uh, this is the special Nintendo Labo, Nintendo Switch console. As you can see, both the dock and the console are Nintendo Labo themed. And, uh, and even the feel is really, really cool. Yes, the, oh, the, when you touch it, it's, yeah. it's like it's unique. Yes, of course, it's uh, really a unique tactile experience. So this is the dock, the console, and the two Joy-Con. We wanted just to showcase the real thing before. And uh, um, here it is. Joy-Con, yeah. by the way. <laughs> oh, and we only have it for the uh, content creators, right? We yes, don't have it for anyone else. We don't, you don't get to take one home, I'm sorry. Uh -huh. <laughs> but people still have time to join the Creators Contest yes. Europe because it's running until the 7th of September. Yes. So um, if you still want to join, go to the Nintendo Labo website and see how you can participate. Yeah, I would suggest to get, get your creative juice flowing and start creating a new toy con. Maybe just check out Twitter or Facebook at Nintendo. You can already see some interesting like creations. Maybe you get an idea of what you could like create and then send in and join the contest. Yeah. Yes. So it was a small but a significant update, I think, from us uh, here in the Nintendo Right Cube related to Nintendo Labo. Yeah, so the, the Nintendo Labo vehicle kit comes out on the 14th of September. Um, the update to Mario Kart 8 Deluxe will come after the vehicle kit comes out. And um, please don't forget to join the Creators Contest Europe if you want to get your hands on the Nintendo Labo themed special edition Nintendo Switch. Exactly. So guys, thank you very much for this presentation. It was really nice for me to see you guys play and I can't <laughs> wait to try it out myself. I hope you guys are happy to see more Labo vehicle kits as well. And I hope you guys will send in more creations for the Content Creators Contest. I'm excited also to see you again in the next video. I hope you guys will join us. So, see you. Bye. 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 Bye.